Hi everyone, welcome back to Unlimited Cruise, episode 2, part 5, first blood part 4. Every time you say episode 2, I'm like, oh crap, am I looking at the wrong episode? I oh no. It up. But no, they just went for a Rambo naming scheme. Yeah. There's nowhere to jump to. That's bottom point. Enter the random jump cut. <laughs> Cooking? I wonder what's for dinner. God you had damn it. <laughs> it, it! It was you this time. I fucked up, dude. We can't resist. Look, I talked about it with Kirby1917. Uh huh. And he said it's like we said. It's ruined us for life. It really has. CDI references are a hell of a drug. <laughs> Them goddamn Phillipsmen. They wow, had like... no idea the power they were toying with. <laughs> <laughs> they created a weapon of mass destruction, but only created five consoles for the entire world. <laughs> a weapon to rival Metal Gear. <laughs> I like to think of as the CDI and the 3DO as like the rings uh, made in Mordor. <laughs> <laughs> and like the, you know, those are like some shitty consoles, right? And then there's the Virtual Boy to rule them all. <laughs> <laughs> I remember way back, like in 1998 or some shit. What, what's I, all this I'm looking at now? Techno. <laughs> I can see uh, the music. So, I, way back in 98, I like saw a guy running around with like one of those sweater headbands, like sweat uh -huh. headbands, to hold the Virtual Boy onto his face. <laughs> yeah, it was glorious, dude. And like he hadn't cut off the pedestal. You know what? Uh -huh. I, you know what I mean, right? Yeah, so it, like the little, it like, looked like he thing. had antlers, dude. He had, <laughs> like, <laughs> it <Did> was weird. <laughs> so, anyways, we had that techno piece there because I sh I wanted to show yeah. you run all the way back there instead of jump cut again. Well, now that you mention that, dude, that that sounds like some awesome, and by awesome I mean terrible thing to show up with at Comic Con or something. <laughs> I've never been to Comic Con, and I really don't have any particular interest in going to any kind of a con. Look, the, the real question is, you, well, the only way well, you could you well, you to, get into uh, Comic Con fair. by being a, a, a bad voice actor, okay? Uh, uh Comic Cat, yes, but uh, other things, not so much. If there's maybe one specific thing to go for, then yeah. And now the stuff I want to go for isn't even, like, Animu, because just why? Why bother with dubs? Well, on the subject of dubs, though... Yeah, we, I, I we... know. I, I, I brought this up for a reason. Okay, it, so we're both on the same level here. We're on the same so page. We, we, I it, started playing Kudelka for the PlayStation 1, and it has some fucking amazing voice acting. I was blown away. And here's the kicker. It's actual English voice acting. What? You link- yeah, see, I told you! Like, yeah, you know, voice acting can be good! And the last time we talked about this, you were taking a rather uh, absolutist stance on the matter. Well, it's just so rare. Like, I've played yeah. so many video games, and this is like the first time. Like, even playing Metal Gear Solid, the voice acting is so weird, and... Like... It, it doesn't feel connected at all while in that game like it's really weird right though the, the I don't voice know, I, acting I, I, is I good I like Metal Gear I like the Metal Gear oh yeah me too I love it I, 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 I think the voice acting is fine in that I, I like it a lot too but it feels so static uh -huh. is that the right word or st I mean stilted yeah that w that's what I meant that's the correct word yeah uh in the Japanese versions, though, mm -hmm. it's the same guy who voices Gold Roger, who does, uh, mm -hmm. I believe, it's either Gold Roger or 
the guy who does uh, Blackbeard, who does okay, the voice yeah, for. Okay, uh, yeah. I can, yeah, I can picture it now. I can so envision it, it in my brain. It has way more of a guttural punch to it, the voice. Mm -hmm. And a lot of the voices, really. But that doesn't mean it's bad. I, I misspoke on that. I, I do think it's still good. And I don't cringe when I play the game in English. I mean, have you played any Fire Emblem game in English? It's cringeworthy. It's just awful. Uh, it, I, I don't have any interest in doing so. Look, the new game, and it's not even Nintendo's fault this time. The new game, what what the fuck is it called? The re-release of the second game of Fire Emblem Gaiden? Fire Emblem Echoes, Shadows of Valencia, just came out. And, uh, you know, it's really weird. They couldn't get a licensing for one song. Mm. So they had to dub it in English. Oh, God. Yeah. Not even the, the one song. They just dubbed the entire game. Like, why not just change that song? You fucking retards. Triggering. <laughs> so anyways, the first thing I oh, did was let, turn off the Let's not go down that rabbit hole. <laughs> <laughs> I, I could go on I could go on for hours. Hours long time? It is. It is. Anyway, so yeah, Kadelka, good voice acting, good game, check it out. PlayStation One. Yeah. Voice acting can be good if the actors are invested, if there's direction. There's one it's problem not... with that game, though. Yeah. The the characters are actually from Wales. <laughs> like mm. England yeah. and Ireland, and they sound like Americans. Nice. Hey, look at this, Nick. Ah, uh, <sighs> yeah. Alright, so this is a mini-boss, and it has as much HP as you would expect it to have a shit ton. <laughs> and here's the kicker. The kicker? I see what you Get did it? there. Yeah, alright. That's, that's a good joke. Do not steal copyright 2017 flock log. Flock alright. Yeah. So, this guy actually drops map pieces. Sorry for that uh, slurping noise earlier. I'm drinking some water. That's good. Very good. Water is good. But now I'm out. So, so the PX, whatever the fuck it's called, PX10 or PXX, I don't know what the Shichibukai robots are called anymore. I forget. Uh, they actually drop map pieces. So there's multiple of them, and we'll be seeing them in multiples. Hey. But the problem is, they only drop map pieces on certain islands. Wow. That's annoying. And even, and even then, it's super rare. Super! Oh. Alright, it's going ape shit mode. It keeps on going like this for a while, by the way. Hmm. And as you can see, the damage is not minimal. Not at all. I do find it rather weird that they suddenly decide to introduce this on, on this island. Like, oh yeah, here's a mini boss. And then it turns out. There's only one mini boss on every island from now on. Mm. <laughs> like what? And it's the same guy every time. I for I forget if there's a mini boss on Island Tree. I I don't think so, but definitely on four. Frankie. <laughs> Look, I'm fucking this up royally. Basically, yeah. the way to tackle this correctly is you dodge, you do a dodge roll, and then you what end up... What is dodge? <laughs> yeah, well, in this game, it's really important since it buffs your damage you're going to do on your next attacks. So what you do is you basically run up to them, you dodge, and then you do some sick damage. <laughs> Mysterious parts. That's another thing, only these guys drop it, and you need mm -hmm. a shit ton of them to upgrade some of your items, which is so frustrating. Like, stop. <laughs> stop it! Get some help! If we're, if we're trying to, uh. 
Do you use current ear memes? This is drugs, and this is your head, or whatever the fuck it's called, like the, you know, those PSAs. <laughs> oh, that's from the 90s? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is your brain. <laughs> this is your brain on drugs. And then there's the, and then there's the follow-up one to that. Where that chick went ape shit and started wrecking her kitchen. Yeah, yeah, I love that one. We got a clam. I like how it's called a striped clam, and it has that typical color differentiation like striped panties. <laughs> I'm not even joking. <laughs> You had to go there. Look, dude. Look. This is the, this is the most professional. Let's this play is America. Well, <laughs> technically, neither of us are in America right now. No, I know. That's what makes or it amazing. Or all of us in America. What? <laughs> okay, Keanu. <laughs> Whoa. God damn it, what is this fucking let's play? It's yeah. such a fucking trade. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I know. When, when was the last time we talked about something in the game? Like five I've... minutes ago? Yeah, five minutes ago. That's a long <laughs> ass time. Look, let's be honest. Dude. If the game was any any more interesting, we would actually be talking about it. We game. would, we would. I mean, not to say that it's an ultra bad game, right? But you can just feel it's a cash in on the. Yeah, I mean, I, I, on I love One Piece, one. but uh, you know that doesn't mean I can't be critical of things related to it, or I even One it... Piece itself. Even. Yeah. What, what makes me mad is that they released, re-released this game for the 3DS. Mm. It really did not deserve a re-release. Yeah. From what my friend tells me, it doesn't have, like, any difference. Mm. Alright, so we need three mysterious parts for to upgrade yeah. our pickaxe. So, yeah, now one you know of, what I meant down. grinding. Yeah. There's one down! Alright, there's our obligatory Star Wars reference. <laughs> one down. <laughs> my god. Well, if we're going meta... That was really we might as go, well, uh, go all I the way. I almost thought I was into Paprika anime. I haven't seen that one, actually. I've heard good things about it. I've seen... Like, from what I've seen about it, like, yeah, the art is supposed to be really it's pretty. Yeah. Yeah. It... Well, it's a movie, right? Pretty crazy movie. In hindsight... If I were to let's play this game again, and I would actually be a good let's player, I would uh -huh. probably cut out all these fights because they're just not interesting. Yeah. Like, them dodging, like whatever. Like, oh, I'm gonna use an attack. No, I'm not. Ha, I'm gonna use an attack, and then you hit him, does almost no damage. Meanwhile, there's two fucks in your back. Yeah. Well, I mean, then, then again. Up for them. If you did do that, then people would say, Well, I wanted to see you fight him. Like, I'm, I'm just doing my laundry. I want to have something to listen to. Oh, that's true. So that would mean you'd have to do two versions of this. One for them, and then one, and then one to satisfy the people who w want to see the um, abridged version. That used to be a thing on YouTube, I remember that. Like yeah. people having two or three different versions of a video. Like, here's a video with grinding and commentary. Here's a video without grinding and commentary. Yeah. Here's a video without grinding, with no commentary. <laughs> it's... It, 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 go through every permutation and... Uh... Yeah, it never ends, and I'm sorry, like... Even now, I'm thinking I'll, I'll even take the no commentary versions offline because I'm just done ma like wasting so much time on that. Yeah. Like, if you want to see a no commentary version, play the game yourself. <laughs> that's that's what I think. Hmm. Well, my one counter to that would be when I want to find out how to do something in a video game, and my Google foo leads me to a YouTube video. 
Sometimes I just want to see the 20 seconds or what have you. I actually gameplay. did that for this this game. Good. And all there was were some really shitty videos made by Mexicans with a potato. And I mean, not to hey, hate on them because hey, it was don't talk, still don't really. Talk, don't talk shit about potatoes. <laughs> like, even though it was made with crappy quality, you could still, like, even me, who doesn't speak a word of Spanish, could mm. still understand what to do. So, yeah. There were, technically, they were good videos, but yeah, from a certain standpoint, it's like, oh my god, why would you even upload this crap? But hey, it's YouTube. I can <laughs> do hey, with the crap. <laughs> that's none of my business. I'm still uh, see. I'm still using ancient memes. I think even the Michael Jordan one is a couple of years old, honestly. <laughs> Okay, I, had I, ha I, I haven't um, updated my memes folder. I don't think there has been any new meme introduced to my meme folder in like the past seven years. I still cannot hear the fart sound in that like you can. <laughs> it sounds like that, um, that Star Wars video you linked. <laughs> sounds like a really meaty fart then. <laughs> taco taco burrito Well speaking like speaking of me being able to hear something and someone else not being able to in this case it's just me being a a sick fuck Okay But in other, but in other cases in a Sonic CD the US version that creepy ass boss music with Eggman slash Robotnik laughing in the background. That has been way too long, and I do not recall. No, it's it's, it's fine if you don't. Uh, my point being, when I played that as a kid, I I thought, oh man, you know, you can hear him laughing in the background. That's so creepy. My brother insisted, what laughing? I can't hear it. So I don't know. I don't know if he couldn't hear it or if he was trolling me. <laughs> We will never know. I could ask him, but uh, he <laughs> might not. He, he might not remember whether he was trolling me either. He's just gonna be like, "What you talking about, Willis?" Yeah, he probably would say it like that. Honestly, <laughs> he, probably, probably, he probably would say those exact words. <laughs> All right, so this is something you want to pick up, like the cotton ball thingy-majigs. You want to pick those up because they are used to lengthen the uh, fishing rod line. Mm, mm, mm. Which I grinded a bit here. Well, not in this video in particular, but I did grind it later. It's called fluff, okay. <laughs> um, and then I ended up never using it. Because well. of video games. We can see that ominous looking uh, plant yeah. in the background there. Okay. What did you do yeah, that bro. for? <laughs> well, actually, I think I actually tried to walk across the water to see if I could get there without yeah. doing the... Like, I just wanted to know, right? Yeah, like, yeah. Hmm, if you level up Brook far enough, can you run across the water all the way to the boss fight without having to use the trigger for it? Hmm. That would be, in yeah, that would be interesting to know. But then I realized... My Brook Fu was not strong enough. No. Uh, not enough. Not enough! Alright, which game is that from? Ah, crap. Ah, I... I give up. Tell me. Snowboard kits for the N N64. Ah, okay, okay. If you run into a box when you don't have 100 gold, the, the announcer is like, NOT ENOUGH! Okay, yeah. <laughs> I know, yeah, you've, pl you've let's played that one, but uh, probably the reason why it, it didn't spring immediately to my mind is that I didn't get to play that one growing up. That is, like, if you ask me what is the best N64 game... Snowball uh, Kids, yeah. It would definitely be up there. Yeah. Like, I don't know uh, what would win. 
It looks ah, like it's possible. It does. It probably is, really. But, instead of keeping on trying that, let's actually do it the way we have to. Well, the PlayStation had its own kind of snowboard kits kind of game, right? Like the uh, SSX. air borders or, yeah. you know, like snow... what the hell was it called? I'm well, pretty it, sure. I'm pretty sure it was SSX. Hold on. Well, you had Snowbird Kids Plus. Okay. Uh, well, the one. All right. The, the game I played on the PlayStation growing up, the snowboarding game I played was SSX. It, it wasn't Snowboard, Snowboard Kids. I'm sure there was a version like that, but I'm, I'm just saying what I had. Well, the the game. Well, I picked it up while I was lodging with you in Japan. Yeah, yeah. The Snowboard Kids uh, Plus. But it never came out in outside of Japan. Mm -hmm. And it's 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 a good version of Snowbird Kids, really. For me, the second Snowbird Kids is not that good, but that's also because I didn't grow up with it. It only mm. came out in Japan, America, and Australia, but not in Europe. That's so How odd. weird is that? Yeah. Huh. Now I own both versions. I own the PAL version and the Japanese version. I think I even own two Japanese versions of Snowbird Kids too. <laughs> or as it's called in Japan, Super Snowbird Kids. We got wood. That never yeah. gets old. It ne no. Unfortunately, no, it doesn't. <laughs> Not for us. Not for us. I love that, uh, them eyes. <laughs> they remind me of that fight with Wapple when he gets thrown away and his yeah. eyes are like bulgy. Or like something and happens I'll... and he just pulls open, pulls his eyes wide open like, yeah. what? We're having jump cuts all over the place because nobody wants to see the, doing travel like 24-7. <laughs> Healing candy is insane, by the way. All the candies are crazy. So I wanted to show that off because I just happened to catch a bug and it dropped the sap. And then it yeah. gives you that prompt, right? Like I just wanted to show people that. Meanwhile, we're still on this route to make it to uh, the next boss fight. That's so frustrating. Yeah. yeah I, you could see I got tired of it. <laughs> that face. <laughs> These uh, standalone plants, like the vine ones, they actually have medicinal herbs in them. Hmm. Let, let's just say, like, 90% chance that that drops. Look like, looks like we found some kind of an, like an, an alcove inside of here. Because it seems to, like, glow blue, so there has to be some water down there. I don't hmm. think you saw it too well, but you'll, you'll see it later. Wow, we found a fucking map piece! Nice! On video, it can happen, people. Oh, it can't be. Wow. That reminds me of the puns I've seen in Splatoon 2. Oh, yeah? Yeah, all of the puns are like something with fish. Hmm. Like, instead of for real, it's for eel. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Like that's some good localization, if you ask yeah. me. Yeah, that's some that's some good shit. It, yeah, you can't hate on it. Uh, yeah, then, at some point you, you you gotta tip your hat and say, okay, well done. And this is so, the outfit uh, I was talking about. But other things, I I, I still reserve the right to uh, be salty and miserable. <laughs> hey Nick. Yeah. I wonder what's down here. I wonder. All right, all right. What do you? What do you? Uh, you know what's ahead. I haven't. I haven't watched ahead. I don't know what's ahead. I don't know who makes these videos. 
<laughs> not enough GP. Not God enough. God damn it. I'm not even sure anymore if I ever went back there to pick that up. That hmm. I. I'm not even gonna try to find out anyway. <laughs> For something like that. Yeah, I know it's a video game, but, uh. In-world continuity and whatnot. Luffy could easily jump up there or pull himself up there. <laughs> Hit the ducky. Too many items. I wish. I You're wish they gave you like. If anything, you can make an upgrade for so much things. I wish they gave you an upgrade for your backpack. Yeah. Where's Battle Frankie when you need him? Or is this, or is this gonna be? Yeah. Wait, what was it in the? Uh, if I remember my googling correctly, the Japanese version of Legend of Dragoon had a backpack item upgrade, but the English didn't. This again, damn it. <laughs> Why? <laughs> it leads the fuck down here, dude. <laughs> so there's the <laughs> There's the wild ending to our question of last time. Where the fuck does it lead? But go ahead, you were talking about uh Legend of Dragoon. I was done no, I finished. Oh, I, okay. I wasn't expecting to run to memes. <laughs> I think you were about to say I'm working on the videos. <laughs> ha! Good one! <laughs> I know, what a knee slapper! <laughs> now, I really like this particular cutscene. I fucking love it. See, the cutscenes have so much charm in them. It's unbelievable. I'm gonna need to go back and uh, do a frame by frame on the chopper screaming. Yeah, it's it's fucking amazing. It deserves its own GIF. How it, triggered it, are you? Make it the thumbnail. <laughs> Never. Actually, no, speaking of that, no, yeah, speaking of GIF, I think the developers of the format saying that GIF is the official pronunciation is master level trolling. Yeah. I, I have to admire it. I know. That's why they made it with a J instead of a G. What? <laughs> That's the thing, right? Like, if they wanted to call it GIF, why not J-E-F? Well... You know, like, soft G does exist, like, in words like giraffe, but the fact that the G stands for graphical, it would yeah. make sense for... It was, no, it... The reason it's funny, it, it... G standing for graphical, it would make sense for it to be a hard G, but the fact that they're saying, oh, no, it's a soft G, is what makes it funny. Because it... Oh, it doesn't make any goddamn sense to pronounce it Jif. <laughs> it doesn't make any goddamn sense, but because it's official, I have to say, well, goddamn it, now I have to choose between doing what's officially correct and. Well, like that and sounding like an idiot who doesn't understand English, or do the rational thing and be technically incorrect. And, and the fact that I have to, and the fact that I have to make that choice, it it burns. So <laughs> hats you off could to always, the developers. You could always drop it and just create a web movie, a dot w, w a e b m, a webm. You and your modernization. Yeah! 
楽しいねさすがだな強き者よお前の力見せてもらおうか名誉赤髪若き力がここまでやってきたぞああ鷹の目こんなに楽しい日は久しぶりだ鷹の目シャンクス鷹の目と赤髪オーカ七部会と四皇が二人同時に出てくるなんて七部会と四皇だとお化けより恐ろしい己を知り世界を知り少しは強くなったかロロノアさあな俺の一味に負けねえ仲間を集めて世界一の財宝を見つけて海賊王になるんだったなルフィどうだその後は最高の仲間を見つけたあとは世界一の財宝を見つけて海賊王になるだけだそうかだったら見せてもらおうかお前たちの覚悟がどれほどのものかを I fucking love it Yeah Let me just Let me put that out there that the fight is rather brutal as you can imagine If you're up against two of them then we, yeah that's two giant health bars staring down at ya The health bars are fine, but the damage output they do is insane. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that that was something else right there. Mm -hmm. Also, they still haven't fixed the bug, where if you have an item equipped and you're on the ground, you can't unequip the item and you can't dodge roll or quick roll out of an attack. You had one fucking job. Like it's sh it's shit that that like that that makes you frustrated, right? Yeah. Like they had an entire game in f uh, before it, even two, and they still have fixed bugs from two generations before. <laughs> Why? It is rather frustrating. If you were wondering, the skill determination. It's actually hot. The lower health your crew has, the more damage you do. So Makes often sense. than not, you'll have people on YouTube doing like speed runs of this game. There's probably some. I'm pretty sure they'll be like playing at one HP or some shit. Wow. Yeah, this turns out to be quite a clusterfuck, right? I did not want to use it, but okay. They're not giving you a break. Nope. Luckily, it's Zoro who does some insane damage. We didn't see the attack. I'm kind of glad we didn't. <laughs> Look at this. I'm still stuck because I have an item equipped. I cannot dodge. I have to wait until my character gets up out of its own. Oh, well, you That's saw right. that one. Yep, that's right. We died because I couldn't dodge. Get good. Yep. Fucked. I love it. Frankie is insane, dude. <laughs> Frankie literally does not give fucks. It's so hard to predict Shank's movements, though. Alright. What was it? That was a clean punch! <laughs> Umaki yokero yo. <laughs> like, make sure you dodge this one. Thank you! <laughs> I love it. I love how passive aggressive Shanks is. He's such a nice guy. Like, make sure you <laughs> dodge this one, or else you're gonna be cut in fucking half. Of course, I had to insta gib him. Yeah. You did the right thing. I love the way this attack looks. 
Its hitbox is also huge. So there's Smog and Ornstein dead. Yep. <laughs> Come on and slam. Good reference, good reference. Shit to develop. Yeah, that was productive. Mm -hmm. Although it is still like it's like I said before, go ahead and try to find this fucking treasure chest that he lo uh, like got onto the ship. Right? Mm -hmm. It doesn't fucking tell you where. Why, game? <laughs> Like, was it that hard to just put it on top of the ship, like, right there where you're spawning? Like, here it is. It is kind of cool, though, that they, like, open up the ship for you. Oh, yeah. look at that. Here they are. We got some salt, all right. And a gold orb. Now... <laughs> Believe it or not, we've almost cleared the way to go to Island Tree. Really? Really. In fact, we have, I believe. And that's the key. We're going to need that item we just saw, the Mini Mary, for Island Tree. Hmm. It introduces a new kind of, uh, you know, element to the gameplay, albeit not the best one. But fine. It's still something else, and you've got to give them credit for what they tried. We're going to see soon, next episode. Cool. Which is obviously going to be recorded right after this one, right, Nick? Oh, man, it's, it's midnight. <laughs> and I have work in the morning. Granted, 
it's in the afternoon, so... Uh, I'll need to do I'll need to do a thing or two if we uh, record right after this. That's Nick's way of saying okay. Yeah, yeah. So it is. You, so there, I made a new climb attack and unlocked some new moves that we're not going to be using. Huzzah! Anyways. I will judge you harshly because that wouldn't be hypocritical at all. We'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye. Bye.